YouTube, welcome back. It's your boy Rum Spanker, and I'm bringing you some crazy gameplay as well as the MX Garand. I finally unlocked it. Now, if you play Black Ops 3, you know the MX Garand is a gun that you can rarely get. You have to go to the black market, you gotta open these packages. I mean, it's not something you just, okay, I just unlocked it by reaching a certain level, by reaching a certain amount of kills. No, you have to actually earn it by using those crypto keys or by buying it. People are spending money to get these weapons. Listen, just today, I've unlocked this weapon, and I didn't use any money. I'm just so happy about it. I've used already like 10 bucks trying to unlock this thing, but that was like a month ago. I'm like, you know what? I'm not trying to do it anymore. I finally did it through crypto keys, through the actual gameplay. And here's my review of it. This is my very first game. My very first game with the MX Garand, and I made 55 kills, 4 deaths. Now, that's my normal, you know, that's my average, whatever. But using a one-shot gun, it's just, it's just, this gun is incredible. All right, so first of all, let's get into the gun. It's an eight-round gun. You cannot reload. This is what was killing me here. You can't reload. It was like it's, it was a weird habit I had to break here. You have to wait until the gun is completely dry before you even try to reload. All right, once it reaches zero, that's the only time you can reload. And you have to actually push reload. It won't just reload on its own. So it actually got me killed at some point in the game. But I was like, you know what? I'm liking this gun. It seemed like it's like, like nowhere, no matter where I hit the enemy, it was like a two-round shot kill. So uh, it was actually pretty good. My aim is already very decent, so it was actually pretty good. Uh, the only complaint I had about this gun, like I said, was like the eight rounds, and you have to wait till it's dry. So I died like, you know, out of the four times that I died, I died a couple times because I couldn't reload or, you know, it's brand, I'm brand new to this gun. So I wasn't used to it. But uh, once you get those shots on target, it seems like two shots and they're going down. They're going down really, really easy. Uh, so... Great gun, I would have to say it's very powerful. You know, some might complain, some might say it's overpowered. Um, but I would say no, because I have it and I don't want it to get nerfed. So it's not overpowered. It is not overpowered, all right? Now, um, as far as the gun mechanics go, as far as moving around mobility, uh, if you watch my previous videos, if you know my play style, I run around like crazy. I'm running and gunning. I'm trying to get in the enemy's face. I'm continuously trying to chase down the enemy team. This is probably not the best gun for doing that. If I didn't have any skill, I'd probably get I'd probably get my butt handed to me doing something like this. But I was running around, getting in the enemy's face. I think I dropped like triple wraps or quad wraps on this round here. And uh, this gun was uh, part of the reason why. I mean, as soon as I got locked on target, I'm dropping these guys. Um... As far as the sound of the gun, the, the, sun, the gun sounds sick. I mean, anywhere around the map, once you hear that, it has a distinct sound. Once you hear that sound, the ding, 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 you know somebody's using the MX Grand. And uh, it's like an epic sound once it reloads. You actually hear like, bing, you hear like this, like this really weird, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to do that again. But you'll hear like this really weird noise, and uh, it's, it's, it's an awesome gun. Um, as far as the reloading... I, after, I think at the end of this round, I uploaded some hardcore gameplay for you guys, so you could see, I think I put extended mags on, which gave me 12 rounds, by then I unlocked extended mags, um, so the reloading wasn't too much of an issue, but if you notice my gameplay, since you can't reload, what I'll try to do sometimes is I'll just spray a bunch of rounds into the ground somewhere, just to be able to reload again, uh, so... I put the extended mags on at the end of the round. You're going to see some hardcore gameplay. I edited that in. And uh, I put the extended mags is 12 rounds. And I put, I believe I put fast mags. So it was a faster reload. But the reload itself, if you can see from this gameplay, the, re the reload itself was actually decent. It was actually pretty pretty quick. Uh, which is necessary because I'm saying if you're, if you're using this 8 round gun and you go dry in front of the enemy, I mean, you need to reload quick. You know what I mean? It's not just like, ah, oh, let me just. No, no, no. You need to reload because you can't even shoot. You've got nothing there. Uh, but this this gun, I, I really was pleased with it. Uh, really happy I unlocked it. Um, I think once you see my hardcore gameplay, I think I put the Elo sight on it at some point. But I took the Elo sight off because the stock iron sights it were just they're just great. Uh, the iron sights were great for just locking right onto the enemy, shooting where I need to go. The rounds pretty much go where I need them to go. If you notice my gameplay here, I'm jumping around a lot. So at some points in time, the gun wouldn't go where I needed to go. So I got to throw a couple more rounds at these guys. But um, other than that, great gameplay, obviously, from your boy Rump Spanker. You know your boy Rump Spanker's bringing you some great gameplay, but obviously, great gameplay with a brand new gun that I've never really used before. Um, as you can see here, like at this point, I actually got killed because I was trying to reload for the enemy, but it is what it is. Now, as you can see here in my class here, down here below, I've got, you know, Bone Stock MX Grand. This is what I was running with in this round with 55 kills. Bone Stock, you know, nothing on it. Um, trying to make it do what it does because, hey, what else will you do? You know, the gun's bone stock from the store, nothing else on it. So uh, this is what I this is what I had for you guys. Um, 
And I also, I also added a little paint, just something different for myself, a little paint at the uh, at the paint shop. I kind of modded the gun myself, threw a little paint on there, threw a little Nuketown, then added a little yellow paint for myself. It actually looks like a harpoon gun, um, but I'm actually going to show this down below as well. I added that paint, and that's what you're going to see me using in the hardcore. Now, here's where we're going to get into the craziness. In hardcore, in hardcore, this thing is literally 99.99999999999% nine, nine, of the time this thing is a one hit kill i mean as you can see here i'm dropping these guys like you know it's 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 incredible one hit kill as soon as that as soon as that um that round makes contact it's like a one hit kill so i was running around making it happen with that um look at this one hit kill you know what i mean there's no oh you know maybe i gotta shoot him a couple more times no this thing is epic you know this thing like i said it's not overpowered please don't complain don't complain to treyarch i don't need this thing nerfed i'm loving it right now i'm running around like crazy with this thing it's one hit killing people in hardcore don't complain about it please just keep it quiet just keep it quiet it's between you and me and the mx Garam. all right so uh thanks for watching guys um i the other night i played with one of the subscribers uh it was an awesome dude awesome dude hopefully we're gonna play again today listen guys if you want to play with me hit me up on yahoo uh rumspanker at yahoo.com hit me up on uh, instagram it's also rumspanker or hit me up on my xbox live it's rumspanker okay guys thanks for watching uh please subscribe drop some likes down there and hope to see you guys on the uh, gameplay